A Central Indiana Police Department has come up with a unique way to improve public safety. Eyewitness News reporter Emily Longnecker is at the police station in Markleville with a look at how the department plans to be more accessible to the people it serves. Emily? Well, John, this is the inside of the Markleville Police Department. It's small, but so is the town here, population 525. And that means more often than not, the doors to the police station are usually locked. That's about to change, though. And you'd think, as a citizen, if you run to a police station, I'm going to get help. That's not always the case, though, in Markleville, with a police chief that only works part-time and nine reserve officers who volunteer to patrol the streets four to five hours a week. So what happens if you need help and the door here is locked? You just come to the police department, come to our safe haven room, lock yourself in, call the 911 phone that we'll have provided. That safe haven room Markleville Police Chief Tim Basie's describing doesn't exist yet. It will, though, if the department can raise the money to build one. They've created a GoFundMe page. The door's going to be open 24 hours, so you can run into the room, uh, lock it behind you, and then no one will be able to see you. If someone is in need, uh, needs emergency assistance of some kind for whatever reason, I think this is an awesome idea. Linda Fessmeyer's already donated money towards the safe haven room. It's like kind of going outside the box and thinking about the community. I think it's wonderful. The chief says he can see it being used by anyone trying to escape an abusive situation who's trying to get help quickly. He adds that a majority of calls his department gets are calls for domestic violence. If, uh, if someone's getting abused at home, uh, if they know there's someplace they can go, I mean, it might, might be an option for them to come here and uh, report it. The safe haven room will have a steel door that locks and a camera inside so a 911 operator can see the person who needs help. The chief estimates an officer could be to the safe haven room in less than five minutes. My hopes would be people would think if I see little Markleville, Indiana is doing this for their citizen, maybe we should do it for ours. And some of the same reserve officers who patrol Markleville streets are going to be helping to build this room. They hope to be finished by the end of the summer. John? All right, thank you. Emily Longnecker in Markleville tonight.